Join me as I save Mother Earth. No, that's might be, that might be too much. Join me as I save the world. In today's episode, how do you do it? Welcome to Stories of My Life. Oh, oh. This is the head. This belongs to Ulf. I've got the other one in there. It's not to be supposed to be there, but temporarily. Because I had a nail in the wall there. Anyway, today, uh, nothing much happened. I had my second dose. No, my third dose. My booster shot yesterday. Feeling fine. Feeling no... Nothing. I'm not even sore. Some people get sore. Some people get sort of, sort of 24 hours. Well, they get fever and stuff. I know not. Knock on wood. But what else? What's what's going to happen today? It's snowing outside. Um, I'm going to go later today. I'm going to go to the dentist. I don't know what they're going to do to me because I forgot to ask. But that's what I'm doing. But right now, let's go recycle some plastic and cardboard because well i need to because my recycling sort of bags are full so join me as i save mother earth no that's might be, that might be too much join me as i save the world Great, they emptied them all. And the first. Plastic. Yes. Let's go. Are you wondering what I'm doing before getting going off to the dentist? This is what I'm doing. I'm sort of pruning and taking away all these dried things from my from the herbs. Oh my god, in the window. This is parsley and some sort of, I don't know. This is some sort of, um, I guess, some citrus things. I don't know. This is mint. I'm not sure what this is at all. People, it's time to go to the dentist. Time to go to the dentist. Time to go to the dentist, son. To go to the dentist, son. To go to the dentist. Time to go to the dentist. You're welcome. Oh, what floor? Five. Five? Oh, I'm talking to myself like a madman. Now I'm even singing to myself. No so regret, Rihanna. Here we go, people. Oh, I'm all alone here. <laughs> not, in the not even in the reception. So I'm not allowed to sing a song. No, I won't. But I will. No, I won't. Oh, my door. The doors are the closing by themselves. So there are two things I know they're going to do. I wonder what they're going to do today. First, I need a cap because one of my tooth, teeth is broken. And then they need to sort of extract the teeth as well. Anyway, let's hope that it's um, not the extraction today because I can't, I can't, I can't. But the thing is, they told me that today would be, if I sort of cancelled today, which I wasn't about to do, I had to also cancel another appointment. So this appointment has something to do with the next appointment. So that sounds like a cap to me, right? Is it called a cap? I don't know. I don't know. You even pay with the machines in those. You don't meet anyone in the reception anymore. Oh. A lot. <laughs> Fun fact, I can't feel my tongue and now I will try to vis whistle. Wh whistle! 
almost well done okay people for a couple of kilometers now okay i can't i can't talk with this tongue anyway for a couple of kilometers now i've been trying to this is really hard uh I'm trying to remember how my dentist speaks because she's communicating with her assistant. They do some sort of like that. It's really sort of what oh, I can't. It's not exactly like that, but it sounds very funny. Also, she is from. She has an accent. But she understands Swedish perfectly, which makes her think that we understand her accent perfectly, which some of us don't. To me, that's a typically Swedish thing. When someone's got an accent speaking Swedish and we don't understand, we go, oh, fuck, this is really hard. Should I ask again or not? Or should I just go, ah, ah. Most of the time I go, ah, I know. I'm a coward, but I am afraid to sort of start to seem sort of like they will think I'm saying I don't understand your accent, which is, well, it is what I don't do, but it's a conundrum. I'm eating nuts and talking to Magnus on FaceTime. What are we doing, Magnus? I don't know. <laughs> we are going through, I've got this old... What do you call it? God. Oh, this. Movie clips. Movie. Yeah, this one is filled with old movie clips that we made. So this is from all our travels. And now we are going th going through Tallinn, where we were in 2013. Was it? Yeah. Yeah. And we're just going to check. So I have all the ones that Magnus got because something is happening here. That is what's happening. Okay, people, I just say farewell to Magnus. Uh, he was really tired because he's been working all day. And now I just want to show you here. You can see this is me and... Oh, God, I got so... <coughs> yeah. Yeah. Me and Magnus in Name London. For Anthony Ashley Cooper, the seventh Earl of Shaftesbury. The street was built oh my late God. in the 19th century. So this is something I need to share with you. So... People, here's an update. The snow is not melting. Damn it. Damn it to hell. Skriva personen som hoppar in nu med ett ord, vilket ord skulle det vara? Magnifik. Uh, Om du skulle beskriva personen som hoppar in nu med ett ord, vilket ord skulle det vara? Magnificent. In yes, man tackar, man tackar. Det, that, that, du... would, that would be me. I would say magnificent. Thank you for watching and for liking, commenting, subscribing and following. It really helps and uh, something to do with the internet and the algorithm, I think. So thank you so much.